I'm Richard Miller, and I'm with Mimer USA in Chicago, and we're here to welcome Mr. Stephen Linton and Nick Graham, both from Armadillo Art and Crafts. Henceforth, Mimer products, all the fine art products, are going to be distributed through Armadillo Art and Crafts. It's kind of a, a moment that we've been waiting for to have the size that it takes to offer what the retailer needs. Thanks for the welcome, Richard. Um, yeah, we at Armadillo are, are also very excited about the opportunity presented by uh, the relationship with my Mary going forward. The fit in terms of the product ranges, I think, is is very interesting because uh, with my Mary, you have a company that uh, has very high quality products. Um, the Puro oils, uh, the my Mary blue watercolors, fantastic professional quality products. Um, very similar sort of market situation to Old Holland oils, um, to the Art Spectrum products. So we have that very high grade product, which Armadillo is certainly known for uh, in the My Mary line. But also we have the Classico and the Venezia, which uh, appeal to the student, beginner, uh, artist. And that's an area of the market that we really haven't been able to address thus far with our current product offering. So that's also very exciting for us. Okay. Yeah, I think it's going to be very interesting for us at Armadillo to be able to offer a, a complete line of paints, as in the Classico line, uh, where, where it's a one price, but there are some cobalt pigments in there, there's cadmium pigments, great line of paint at a single price point. It's, it's our best seller, you know, yeah. it's our best selling paint and it's our fastest growing paint because there's so many more students Sure. Uh, but but for them to have the access to afford. cadmium paint in the same price is wonderful. Right. Yeah. And, and indeed, I think something that uh, perhaps a lot of people don't realize that the Classicos are a 60 mil too. So you're you only really get more for your money. You have 50% more for your money. Yeah. Oh. yeah no. It's very hard, as you know, Richard, to, uh, to um, <clears throat> achieve freight minimums with, with just one paint line I mean, when you're buying one paint line from one manufacturer. Um, and you know, Armadillo was in that situation. I think you know when we first started, um, but fortunately, you know, we've evolved over the last ten years to a point where we have uh, a, a vast array of products. Sometimes when I walk around our warehouse, I feel like I'm, you know, shopping in an art materials supermarket. You know, we have paints, we have pastels, we have compressors, we have portfolios, paper, um, and to add the My Mary products into that um, gives every retailer a sort of a one-stop shopping opportunity for a very fine array of products from all around the world, um, which can all be combined uh, to make freight. Uh, I think there's going to be some very meaningful benefits for the retailer. Armadillo has always been very sensitive to the retailer's needs, and we've tried to um, address the challenges that they face on a daily basis and with the old Holland map policy uh, having been in effect now for a few years we administer to great pain sometimes uh, we're, we're there really we're doing that to protect the, the margins of the independent retailer and the fact that my Mary has a very similar policy that's already in effect that is being respected by the major players in the industry is going to make it possible for us to be able to offer yet another of the world's finest paint lines to the retailers, a line that they can be competitive with uh, while protecting their margins. It makes a level playing field and it's, you know, we've looked up to your company for all these years with MAP and we just thought with our little company it just it couldn't be yep. possible. Uh, and we're, you know, we're quite reality. experienced at uh, administering the program so, uh, you know, hopefully it'll be successful. Sure it will be. Uh, I'm sure it will be. Uh, moving forward, I know that we're going to be working hard together to develop programs that uh, support the brand uh, and, and drive sales of the products because, you know, we feel it's not just our job to sell the products to the retailers, it's our job to push customers through the door to buy those products. So, you know, I know, Richard, you've done a lot with uh, working with artists and sampling. Um, we will be certainly continuing that. We'll be looking at exploring different ways of uh, uh, getting to the market, you know, talking to consumers. Um, I think it's going to be very exciting going forward. 
Uh, I love to work with teachers because it's like a magnifying glass. I mean, you say it to one person, but then they say it to 10 people or to 30 people. Absolutely. And yeah. When they fall in love with your product, their students just uh, fall in love with it too. I think that the power of, of, of recommendation is, is one of the strongest things going for a product in our industry. And, you know, when you have good products, uh, artists will talk about them. Well, there's plenty for us to do. <laughs> there is, but we're well, ready to do it. Well, there, there is, and uh, you know, we've got a lot of work to do between us uh, to bring My Mary uh, into the Armadillo's Den, as we might call it, uh, and, and to work together to develop these programs. But um, we would like to challenge you, the retailer, to challenge us to be your most supportive vendor. Uh, we at Armadillo love to say yes, uh, we'd like to say yes to you, so please tell us what makes sense for you and most importantly what makes dollars and cents for you uh, and we'll try and rise to that challenge. Thanks for listening. <laughs>